time seems like the 80s are back, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Thanks in no small small part, I'm sure, to the Atlanta film Netflix hit Stranger Things. But the 80s never left at one North Georgia business, which houses an incredible collection of classic pinball machines and arcade games. And speaking of Stranger Things, Good Days Paul Milliken <laughs> is live at Portal Pinball in Accord this morning. <laughs> Paul doing the best. Uh, the, the best thing about this, I think, though, is so that you don't you don't need quarters, really. I mean, <laughs> you don't you you don't need quarters. But you know what? Calling me Stranger Things, that's a huge compliment, all right? That's the biggest thing in the world right now. So, yeah, I'm a strange guy in a strange place, and I'm loving it. Welcome to Portal Pinball. I wish that I was doing a little bit better on Bram Stoker's Dracula. If I was going to do good on any pinball machine, you know I love horror movies. That would be it. Not doing so well, so we'll keep practicing. But these folks are doing great. And these machines are amazing. Look at that. We've got a Metallica, Jurassic Park, Tron back there. Amazing. The Simpsons. Rep and Fox right here, Star Wars. All the classics are here at Portal Pinball. Now, I know what you all are thinking. Paul, we've seen this place. You, you've been there before on TV. Well, this is a brand new location. This one is an Ackworth. And there's a new addition, I said this earlier, that speaks to my soul, that says, Paul, this is your place. It's a beautiful bar with a beer waiting for me and my buddy Brian standing by, the owner of Portal Pinball. Man, it's great to see you. How are Good you? Good to see you, Paul. Good, man. Uh, long time no see, and this looks amazing. Congrats on the new spot. Hey, thank you so much for coming out. Yeah. We got, what, like almost 40 pinball machines, Amazing. 30 arcades now. So yeah, yeah. We almost doubled our space, so it's really great. It looks great. So why did you decide to move? Was it because you wanted to expand a little bit? We did want to expand, and we did want the option of the bar as well. Yeah. Uh, our biggest request from customers was beer and wine. Yeah, so. makes sense. Okay, so let's talk about this bar, by the way. Did you make this thing? Because it's, it's a real arcade game. It's beautiful. We did. There was three of us, uh, two of my best friends and I. Uh, made this bar. Uh, we took old pinball machines yeah. and basically stripped those play fields and um, filled them in with the color and all that stuff. Yeah, because they've got like holes and stuff in them, so you got to fill that in Absolutely. and then put the top on. And what's amazing is you can control the lighting scheme like with your From phone. The phone right? Exactly. So we can do different color schemes, different <laughs> patterns and effects and stuff. So it was a really neat idea. I had seen one of these bars once before, yeah. but they didn't have any lighting, so we thought we got to uh, light it up and make it look really you cool. You did the thing, man. I love it. And then the bar, too. Let's just talk about the drink served. You really have an emphasis on local breweries, right? Absolutely. We want to do that because we kind of want to show what our local community has to offer. Yeah. And they kind of give us a shout. We give them a shout. Yeah. And it's just kind of a good synergy between us and the businesses. Yeah. Okay, I've asked you this on TV before, but in case people didn't see it, like, how did you get into the world of pinball? When did you start playing with these things? Years ago, I used to ride my bike to a bowling alley. I didn't have an arcade <laughs> or anything. So, But the bowling alley had several pinball machines and arcade games and I noticed I was actually really good at pinball yeah so the thing about pinball is you can win a free game so if you only got a couple dollars if you're good enough at it you can actually play a little uh, longer to yeah. where video games once you spend your quarters you're done yeah so pinball actually allows you to win a free game or match for a free game so yeah I, I really loved pinball in that aspect so I could play a little longer and, and now you're like into the guts of the pinball machines I mean this guy takes them apart he cleans them he replaces them parts it's really amazing to see the work and you mentioned something about a free game so can we talk about how it works in here because I don't have any quarters so can I still play absolutely absolutely <laughs> so how does that work man you don't need quarters or tokens so it's pay by the hour we do uh, an hour for 10 18 for 2 and we have all day pass now for $25 can I tell you something that is the most incredible bargain 25 bucks for all day open play in here and come and go <sighs> All right, this is why I belong at Portal Pinball, and I got my beer waiting. Great to see you, Brian. We've got so much more to talk about this morning, so we're going to hang around first, though. Okay, now we've got, again, we've got some very talented players in here this morning, like the guy at the very end who's a three-time state pinball champion. But I got to, come on, I got to be able to do something. So let me, I've got, I've got my ball in play. Now watch how the master works at Bram Stoker's. Oh, Bram my goodness, Stoker's I'm nervous yep, for okay. him. Oh, yes, fast fit, yes. Yes, lightning quick reflexes. Yeah. Oh, 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 yeah, look. Okay. okay, Paul Milliken yeah, is kidding. Oh. something uh, there. Yeah. Uh, there we go. Wah, wah. There we go. Yeah. Okay, so this game I think is broken. <laughs> that one, yeah. There's something wrong with this one here. Is there a we'll Jaws game there Brian that will match your shirt? A jaw, uh, some kind <laughs> I of didn't jaw. even make fun of your shirt. Sherry did. <laughs> Thank, you know how much I my Thank you for noticing <laughs> the fashion, <laughs> Sherry Lawson. I appreciate that. Thank you. A couple of quick things. My girl. A couple of quick things.
I got to give a shout out yeah. to all my Snellville peeps that used to hang out at the Outer Sanctum back in the day. The Outer Sanctum. Oh, that was the I name of the arcade that. back then. Okay. Good times there. And is, it nice. Tim, is Tim with you today? It is Tim, right? He's with me. Okay, yep. Tim. So you were panning around and I saw something. It may have been over there by the Donkey Kong game. Something that made me realize Paul is right at home in the arcade. Can you kind of move to your right a little? Let's see. No, Wait. let's see. Well, that's the left. Look, all right. Yeah, the, yeah. the, the classic arcade games are around the going. corner. So let's we're see. walking. We're walking see, back. Keep, man, keep going. Oh, there's so oh, many man. great wow. games Keep back going. Here. Keep going. D there's Donkey Kong. I mean, Sharp that, shooter. That. Was on, that it? Because of my lightning quick reflexes. Something on the ground that Maybe made me realize that this is a joust. Where is it? NBA Jam because I'm such a good basketball player. I mean, The Simpsons because I work for Frogger. Keep going. Keep going. We're almost out of time, I know, but this is actually <laughs> perfect. Just burn that time. Is it Dang it. Back out a little Popeye? bit, Tim. There were, there were the little uh, step stools for the Commando? people that weren't tall oh, enough to play. Right. I saw a stack of white oh, step stools. Oh, wow. That, Where are they? Look, that, that, that hurt me, all right? That hurt. I was there? shorter than this when I was playing arcade <laughs> there, games back in the day. I don't stool. see the step stool, but I don't yeah. need it. I don't need uh, it, okay? Uh, I don't look at this. It's, <laughs> it's Paul Milliken sized, all right? I'm playing Jungle Queen Hey, Tim, make sure you find those and get a shot for the next hit, okay? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Up. I know I can count on Tim. All right. Thanks a lot, Paul. <laughs> Portal Pinball is located at Cobb Parkway at Ackworth. Current hours are noon to 10 on Mondays through Saturdays and 1 to 10 on Sundays. Admission for an hour is $10. Two hours is 18 and all day play, $25. Ooh, that's a bargain right there. <laughs> all day. 844 is now.